so what are we doing today? We're just gonna we're just gonna roll. We're just gonna roll. We're just gonna rock and roll. Uh let's continue with renegade inclements. Whatever. No, anyway, we're just gonna try and plow through this aqua hideout ASAP Rocky. There's a bunch of trainers that we probably don't have to fight if we don't need to. Like this person that just goes around in circles, we can probably dodge them as long as we're smart about it. Tenacruel, Delmize, and Mightyana, so even if we run into them, not a big deal. I doubt we'll get to Tate and Liza, but theoretically we could. Can we get MS paint drawings of all mega forms you've used so far this run, please? Okay, okay, yeah, we can do mega evolutions. I don't, oh man, those are gonna be hard though. Those are gonna be hard. You just really don't want me to play the game, huh? <laughs> all right, let's, Let's try it. I'll give it a go. Okay, so what have we used? We've used Mega Aerodactyl, we've used Mega Flygon, and we've used Mega Agron and Mega Audino, right? So you want four? I don't, I don't, I don't remember what most of these look like, if I'm being honest. So we'll 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 do our best, okay? We'll start with Mega Aerodactyl here. So what did I learn from my Meg from my regular Aerodactyl drawing? I learned that I made his face not pointy enough. Or like I didn't give him a neck. So it's something like this. So now he has a neck. And then we'll go like this. Okay. And so then he's definitely got a pair of wings here. And then does he have... Oh, he's he's got little claws. Big meaty claws. And then he's got legs. All right. So this is Aerodactyl. This is, this is regular Aerodactyl. And the good thing one could argue about the Megas is that they don't change much. So we go rawr. And we go like this. So basically the only thing that happens to Mega Aerodactyl is he gets a ridiculously cartoonish goatee and like maybe also like big bushy eyebrows. And it's like, yeah. Maybe he's got some like things here. Like I'm I'm sure he just has like, you know what freaking Megas love? They love just having random, completely unnatural spikes protruding out of every orifice of their body. Like you know, maybe he's got one here and like here. Okay, there's there's a G Max Aerodactyl or whatever. I think that looks pretty good. What's next? Mega Flygon. All I know is that he's got two pairs of wings and he's got like a bunch of like crap coming out of him. Classic, classic Mega. We're gonna start with his body here. And it's gonna go like or start with his head, and then he's like Boom, I got a badonkadonk. And then I can never really remember what his tail looks like. So we're going to give him an aerodactyl tail. And then he's going to go like this. Uh, yep. Keep his dump truck. No, no. Let me give me, let me give him his little adorable arms here. Uh, and then, so if I remember correctly, the mega has two pairs of wings. So it's like, and then he's probably also got some like armor plating because as I said, freaking love armor plating. Oh yeah, look at that. That's the design of a freaking mega evolution. Hell yeah. Unnecessary armor everywhere. Yeah. Give me that armor. Give me that sweet, sweet armor. Woo, armor, armor, armor. Why make a good design when we can just give it armor oh wait we gotta give him his eyes and he's a little cranky oh no he looks sad he looks like a pixar character okay there we go does i gonna have red on him somewhere maybe like here i don't know and then maybe he's got like red armor as well uh i don't know this is really going off the rails folks okay doop 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 I guess this is Mega Flygon. I don't know. I haven't been looking at chat. Why is Flygon's one leg detached in picture? That's a great point. You're right. I totally, I totally fucked that up. Hold on. Donk and donk. There we go. There we go. There we go. Now it's good. All right. I'm sending this. That's fine. What's next? Audino. Mega Audino. Okay. So Mega Audinito. Mega Audinito is like a white and pink thing. Um, so we'll just go with pink here. I don't even know what regular Audino looks like. It's like got the ears here. And then we know she also has a dump truck over here like this. And it's like little legs maybe. <laughs> I don't remember what this Pokemon looks like. This is horrible. Um, does she have like some sort of tail? I really, guys, I really don't know what she looks like here. I want to say she has like weird shit hanging down from her ears too, right? Does she have wings? That's, that, I know Absol has wings. 
Yeah, sure. I don't know. Like, okay, there's Mega Houtino. I, I don't know, guys. I might be totally off on that one. And then what's the last one we did? We did, we used Agron, right? Wait, what the hell does Mega Audino look like now that we're done here? Mega Audino. Okay, I think mine's better. Okay, I did have random shit coming off of her ears, so that's fine. She has a weird bow tie thing. Uh, uh, I like mine more. And what about Mega Aerodactyl? Wow, okay, I actually did that one pretty well. I missed the purple on the wings, but that one's pretty good. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and finish up with Mega Agron. Um, I don't, I can't, uh, this isn't gonna go well either, but so Mega Agron is just like big chungus version of regular Agron, right? He's like, just like a fucking beefcake. And then his helmet is huge too. Something like that. I don't know, guys. <laughs> what the hell is this? What did I just make? I don't, I don't know. You know what? I'm just gonna full send it. We're making hungry hippos or something. I'm not, I'm not turning back. This is the mega agron that we deserve. I'm not turning back. I don't know what a, what's up with his arms. I think I just kind of gave up here. He can have a little claws too. I made him like a mix between like an obese shredder and the rhino guy. This can go here like this. This can go here, here. Okay, there we go. I think he looks worse with teeth. Does he even have teeth? All right, that's Mega Agron, guys. All right, which one's worse? Mega Agron or regular Agron? <laughs> Let's check out Mega Agron. You know what? It's not as bad as I thought it was. We got the headdress, right? Just missed the shoulders. Yeah, and the arms and the legs and the body and stuff. But hey, you know... It's fine. Okay, let's, um, all right, we good. Anything else that we got to clear away before we can play some Pokemon or, or, uh, what are we, what, what's going on here? Feeling great, Dr. HG. Hell yeah. Uh, okay, so I think we're fine to lead with Vicavolt for most of this stuff and just kill most of the Pokemon because Vicavolt be, be busted like that. So this first grunt has Walrein, Floatzel, and Malamar. I wonder if we can outspeed Floatzel. Floatzel at level 84. I just want to check that, but... If we're plus speed, I think we add speed. Uh, yeah, 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 we do. Okay, so I think what we can do is we can just give this a magnet and then kill most of the team. Just make sure it has X scissor and we just bring back up just in case. So let's just like get a, a pretty solid team against these water types together here because mostly water types. I want to bring my comfort Gudra. Man, adaptability from this drag algae is pretty scary, huh? A steel type with relatively good spadef should be pretty good here. Honestly, steel water, steel water. I keep saying this, but steel water would be great. Or I could just kill it with like anything that has earthquake, I guess, and it's faster. Like how fast is drag algae compared to Dawn fan? We should be faster. Yeah. yeah. All right, we'll bring Dawn fan because it's got the study. Leftovers, 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 choice scarf, magnet. I think that's fine. All right, where you at, you sneaky? There you are. So this woman does appear. Is she dodgeable? Nope. Okay. She does look pretty dodgeable though. That's that is probably a waste of time there. Well, it's whatever. Let's just make sure you're hardy. Yeah, there. I feel like all the random trainers are hardy, so we can just thunderbolt. Go, Vin Diesel. For family. Flygon, why am I wearing two hats? Because you guys made me. What hat are you wearing under the socks one? Boston University hat. Okay, I think we should outspeed this guy as well. 224. Uh-oh. Do we outspeed that? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's perfect. Yeah, it's perfect. It's perfect. We outspeed by just a couple of, uh, couple of speed points. It's perfect. Okay, bye, Floatzel. All right, so this guy has a Sharpedo, a Dragalge, and a Muck. All right, Team Aqua Grunt 3. Let's rock and roll. Sure. Why not? Hey, he didn't even protect. What a loser. What a little wiener. What an absolute wiener. I hope this kills. I mean, it's a Sharpedo, so I'd imagine it does, yeah. All right, this gives us a free switch into Don Fan, my boy. Fanny Pack Don Fan over here. Anthony Hopkins, the Elephant Man. I mean, they, they improved that a little bit here. Um, you know, I guess... This is unideal. Kind of didn't think Muck would come out first, if I'm being honest. This should be fine. Oh, it's 84, so we actually do outspeed it. Eat my shorts, Muck. Eat my mother freaking shorts. Okay, I think that one shot, so we're good. Does HG equal Mercury? It does in some circles. The Mercury circles. Um, 
Wow, that thing just did a big ass spin. Did you see that? It's adorable. Will the meaning of HG ever be revealed? Not if I can help it. Uh, all right, this next person has Cloyster, Kingdra, and Skuntank. I don't know if we're fully prepared for that one. Might have to go back to the back to the drawing board. Or wait, wait, wait. That'll just kill Cloyster and Kingdra and. Yeah, okay. Yeah, wait, no, we're fine. Skuntank's gonna come out with Fire Blast, so we wanna kill it quick with this bad boy. You know what they say, right? Adventure is out there. Which do you think is cooler, Team Aqua's uniform or Team Magma's? That seems like a leading question. Is it impossible to get a Milotic in this game? No, I hatched one from an egg, and we have one. Man, I hope this kills. Hi, nice highlights. My girlfriend just got her highlights redone, so. Skuntank? More like dumb tank. <laughs> that shouldn't kill. You know, you can't, you can't be, you can't be everywhere at once is, is what I'm saying, you know? We can go to GP over here. Acquire goop. I bet this is going to do 15 damage. Oh, 10 damage. Beautiful. Dark Pulse. He's going for the flinch. I don't use my pet names in my Nuzlocke anymore. It was sad when they died. Paltro did flinch. That's okay. Wow. Paltro just took all of that damage right back. That's pretty wild. Yeah, and Gudra has poison heal in this game. It's ridiculous. Hammer arm, huh? That seems like a job for Victoria Volt. Let's just Volt switch out of here, just in case we don't kill, but I can't imagine that we wouldn't kill. As I just caught a trap hinge, what is a food name for a Flygon? Ooh, definitely strawberry, because it's green and red. So it's here, and then it's here, and then it's here. Dark Pulse, cool. All right, so um, these electrodes, are they gonna know explosion? Is that something I should be concerned about? I feel like we're at a high enough level where the electrodes shouldn't know. Uh, mirror coat, gyro ball, it will know explosion probably. All right, well, let's hope that we don't, uh, whatever. All right, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to go out and get a team for Matt anyway, so that's fine. This is also pretty good into the electrode, so uh, hopefully we can just one shot it, you know, one shot HG. Oh, where's the master ball? Okay, well we're gonna try and catch this guy. It's level eighty-five. G Willikers, that is uh, pretty scary. All right, well, fingers crossed here, folks. It's okay, because guess what? All we need is a dream and a quick ball. It's pretty douchey there, Electrode. Okay, well, all right, here we go. Here we go. All we gotta do is just go Ultra Ball. Ultra Ball! Meh. Well, we got the master ball. Parasect is laughing from the box. Parasect would die from the explosion. It's okay, I don't really need an electrode, hopefully. Oh well, what are you gonna do? You can't make an omelet without exploding a few eggs. Okay, so let's go ahead and check out Matt. So Matt has the same team as before. Pelipper, Delmize, Heliolisk, Toxicroak, Seismitoad, and Gyarados. Okay, so Pelipper, it's just leftovers. So here's here's what we're gonna do. I think this should be relatively straightforward. So we're definitely bringing Vicavolt. Vicavolt can kill the Pelipper and get rid of the um, rain instantly by going to non-rain setters. We've got Palisand here and we've got Obama Snow. I think Palisand is the best option here. So we bring Palisand. That should bring out the Delmize, but we can set that up like that. I think Gudra deals with Heliolisk. Toxicroak has Swords Dance. Okay, so we need to be careful about that. Sucker Punch and Drain Punch and Gunk Shot. Seismitoad we kill with this guy. I think, uh, or wait, where's um you? I think this wall's Seismitoad. And then I think this guy is a great Gyarados answer. The Kofi Grugas just completely walls the Toxic Rogue. So I think you're right. We should just do that. We're not really not using a Mega here? I guess not. I mean, there's no reason to use a Mega if we don't have to. I don't I don't see a reason to, to be honest. The Delmize is always, I. it's one of those Pokemon that I, it's a Pokemon that I always kind of underestimate here. How did I do it last time? Uh, I I had Mega Aggron, didn't I? I had Mega Aggron last time. Can I squeeze that in somewhere? Yeah, Mega Aggron is fine, but it means I have to replace 
replace something. How much does Drain Punch do to filter Mega? Yeah, that's that's another option, right? Is using using Mega Aggron for Toxicroak. Yeah, so I mean, Drain Punch does nothing. Does it have Swords Dance or Bulk Up? It's got Swords Dance. Swords Dance, and it's Swords Dances. It'll be at plus two. It still doesn't kill. And then we probably kill with like, we even kill with Bulldoze. I mean, Palisand also just takes care of Toxicroak. I keep forgetting that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Palisand takes care of Toxicroak. So I don't need Kofagrigus. Yeah, I totally forgot about that. Let's just bring Mega Aggron. Let's just do the same thing we did last time. That's fine. Um, okay. All right, here we go, Matt. You and me, buddy. Let's do it. Deathless Matt, incoming. Channel UK. All right, Aqua Admin Matt would like to battle. Here we go. So we are just gonna Volt Switch this Pelipper. Should kill. Team Aqua Security is Cheeks. <laughs> yeah. Great. Now let's bring in Palisand and get that sand up, baby. It'd be cool if you went to Toxicroak for some reason. Uh, not gonna lie, that doesn't make a lot of sense to me. What are you even going for? Thunder, Weather Ball, Focus Blast, Grass Knot? You gotta be going for Weather Ball or you gotta be going for Grass Knot. That's kind of annoying because it's gonna do decent damage into my my big girl, but what are you gonna do, you know? All right, Gudra, you're a big, big girl, so this is gonna hurt, but I believe in you. <laughs> Woo. Okay, so we're gonna protect here just to get some HP back. Good job, Paltrow. Get back to full HP. Not quite full HP because of this pesky sand chip, but... All right, so what comes out here after this? Uh, probably Seismitoad, right? So Thunder's gonna do a shitload of damage, but there's not much we can do about that, so we're just gonna bulldoze here. Yeah. Don't crit. 268. It doesn't actually matter. Like, you can crit, I guess. That's a lot of damage, though. Um... Damn, Daniel. Okay, that's fine. Now we should be faster. We should be able to just kill it. I'm gonna protect one more time, just cause uh, there's no reason not to. We're just gonna do some little... Okay, and now because we have speed, we can just bulldoze. Okay. All right, so now let's see Seismitoad, I, I guess. It doesn't, you know, whatever. You know, potatoes. Oh. Ah, that's fine. Let's just go to Potatoes here. He's probably gonna Swords Dance, which is super fucking annoying, but we never die to this, right? Okay, so Sucker Punch, crit at plus two. Does how much to Palisand? Never kills. Earth Power after two Sandstorm Chips does. Oh, but it's Black Sludge. I always forget about that. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna switch here. I've got, I've got faith in Adam Sand here. All right, buddy, ready? Ready, buddy? It's definitely, oh, and it missed. Well, that's about as good as you can get. <laughs> yeah, all right, well, let's see, let's see what happens here. Yep, that's fine, it's not gonna do much. Yep, perfect. Earth power, that's not gonna kill it. I probably, mm, I don't know, I don't know. That was always risky. Ooh, it's gonna hang on with a freaking sliver, isn't it? So I could shore up, but I don't see a reason to. I think we just go for the kill here. I think we just earth power. Yep, perfect. Beautiful. Amazing. Okay. Okay. So now what? Seismitoad? He really likes using his Gyarados last, I guess. Swords Dance at 1 HP. <laughs> yeah, classic AI move. Okay. Gyarados cometh. Um. All right. Here's the, where the fun begins. Let's go Zellweger. I think we have to hard Zellweger this. So he's going to Mega Evolve. This gives him the dark typing, which gives us the uh, the super effective first impression, which always goes first. So with the chip, we should be able to kill this. Waterfall is fine. This should do nothing, which is great. Are we at risk? No, no, no. I don't think we're even at risk to a power whip there. Oh, maybe with the sandstorm chip. Ugh. There's not much we can do though. Here goes nothing. It's annoying because it can crit here because of mold breaker, but maybe we just kill it. We'll see. Got the roll, baby. Got the roll. Good job, Zellweger. Yeah, Power Whip crit probably would have killed us there with the whole 
thing. Um, all right, what are you doing? You're probably going anchor shot, to be honest. I don't really want to switch in Agron on a non-resisted steel gem boosted anchor shot. This is where protect would be nice. I don't even know. Does this... Oh, wait, it's not going to go anchor shot because it resists. It's going to go shadow claw, right? Oh, wait, you know what this is going? This is definitely going uh, rock slide. And so rock slide doesn't kill here. I don't want it going for a random move after if it flinches. So why don't we just switch out? That's cute. That's cute, AP. Good job, buddy. This should now go to liquidation, which is adorable because it's not doing shit. Ooh, we can just fire punch here. AP eating Rockies for breakfast. Hell yeah. Burn. Iron Head Flinch is probably better there. But does not freaking matter. Look at that damage. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. And out of this world. All right, we just got the um, the Seismitoad. It's definitely going Earthquake here, so I could theoretically pivot to avoid like a double crit or something, I guess. But I think it's fine. I think with Leftovers Recovery, even double crit doesn't kill. So we're just going to hard switch into Spike Lee just in case it goes for Liquidation or something. Hey, it's Quinn. Thank you so much for the gifted sub. Or I mean the uh, the sub. That's a lot of damage, 80 exact, but see, we're fine. One thing that still could be bad here is Ice Punch Freeze, I suppose. So maybe we want to protect just to be safe. All right. Seed Bomb! Seed Bomb! Crit me. Do it just, just because you can. You think that Seismitoad is better than Whiskash or Swampert? Definitely not better than Swampert. One shot, baby. I've never used Delmize before. I don't think I have either. It's a very cool Pokemon. Should be like six types, but hey, hey, hey. So I lost too. I don't know why he's White Goodman there, but hey, hey, hey. While I was toying with you, our boss got through his preparations. Our boss has already gone on his way to some cave under the sea. If you're gonna have to give a chase to him, you'd better search this big wide sea beyond Lily Cove. But will you find it then? <laughs> All right, sweet. All right, we've made it. So now we can mosey on over to Moss Deep. So why don't we just end this stream with catching some of the random crap that we can catch on these routes and then head over, you know? That sounds like a good planus to me. So why are we zoomed in? So we got Route 124, theoretically 126, Route 127, 28, 29, 30. 31, Pacific Lodge Town, 132, 133. We already got 134, but then we also have Route 25 and Shoal Cave. And we have Moss Deep. All right, so Moss Deep Town has Pelipper, which we already have. So we guarantee either Floatzel or Sharpedo, or we could guarantee Finneon. So that's kind of boring. But I guess we'll get either Floatzel or Sharpedo. So Route 124, 25, 26, and 27 have all of the exact same Pokemon. Oh, you know what we can also do is we can just use, we can do uh, egg encounters for a lot of these routes. Route 124, 25, 26, and 27. So that's this one, that's this one, that's this one, and this one. So all of these have the exact same Pokemon, and the only thing I haven't gotten, other than from Seaweed, but in the diving thing, I believe it's all one route. It's just underwater, unfortunately. Plus, we have most of this shit already. Yeah, maybe we'll just do some eggy waggies. And then Route 32, 33, and 34, we have everything already here, so that's even more eggs. Hell yeah. Eggs galore, mother truckers. What's in Shoal Cave? Sfeel, Cubchu, Golbat, Celio, Delibird, Dugan. If we get Tentacool, we can guarantee Slowpoke. In the Ice Room, though, I can potentially get Snow Runt, which would be pretty cool for uh, Frostlass. All right, let's just go uh, take care of this madness. Wow, this is a long route. Okay. Oh, hey, buddy. Ugh, that was creepy. I did not like that. That does big dummy damage, 25 to 29.7%. That is quite a lot of damage. Gonna have to be a little careful here, folks. All right, Alamomati. Critical capture, woo! We name her Betty White? Sure, that makes sense. B-E-T-T-Y-W-H-I-T-E. -T -T -E. It does without the space. Okay, that's fine. Okay, we're in Moss Deep. There we go. Let's just uh, touch some grass as it were. Uh, ooh, wait, ooh, wait. What does Moss Deep have to offer? Oh, 
What about this one? Well, actually, I mean, we might as well get some uh, netballs here. So now that we don't have an Alamomati, or now that we do have Alamomati, right? We can we can guarantee Sharpedo on Route 25, 26, or 27. So let's go do that. Wow, so many Jellicens. It's 10%, bro. Thank you. Okay, Sharpedo. All right, Sharpedo. Here we go. Quick ball. Nyeh. That's bullshit, my friends. Go nipple! Nyeh! It's as easy as catching a shark with a net, maybe. I don't know. All right, what are we naming Sharpedo? Sharkira? <laughs> Sharkira's pretty good, but she's not a... I mean, she's in movies, kind of, but not really, you know? Sharkira is pretty good, though. Charlize T is my is still my vote. All right, we'll do Charlize T. All right, Charlize, welcome to the team. Okay, so let's go to Shoal Cave now, I suppose. What is in Moss Deep? Anything? Moss Deep, I can get Floatzel, I guess. Do I not have Floatzel? All right, let's go get Floatzel. Hey, look at him. He's like, hey, I'm here. Hey! Hey! Like this guy shows up drunk to the party. Hey! Who's ready for shots? Hey! Where my where my guys at? Huh? Where my friends? Huh? Yeah. Didn't stand a shot against the one ball HG. We could do Bill Skarsgård. Hasselhoff or Schwimmer. David Schwimmer's pretty good. But yeah, let's do Bill's, Bill Skarsgård. Okay, so now let's go to Shoal Cave, I think. Look, we're at the ice rink. Wee! Wee! Ooh! I knew the Glalalite was gonna be in here, or Glalatite. <laughs> Hi, Articuno. What, what are you up to, buddy? Oh, we got the TM for hail. Hail, yeah. <laughs> okay. The tangles hail, but I'm running. Um, oh, man. Really? Really? Oh, it's ice rock type in this game. Damn. Oh, holy crap. Well, we get Mega Glalie. That's kind of cool, I guess. All right, here we go. Good old quick ball. Yeah. God damn it. <laughs> Bruh. Yeah. That's okay. Critical capture. One button. Come on, come on, come on. We're in yellow health here, folks. Woo! All right. Yeah, I think we definitely do Glady Gaga. <laughs> That's really funny. All right. So, um, this is pretty cool. We got Mega Glagly. So we got Moss Deep, we got Shoal Cave. So the only thing we have left here... So we have 127, 126, 128. We might as well get Lumineon. So 127, we can still get Finneon. So let's go get Finneon. <laughs> Show me Finneon. Oh, okay, cool. All right, Storm Drain. That's pretty cool. All right, Finneon. We can do D Swimmer for this one. Good old Ross. Ross would be a Finneon. Classic Ross move. Okay, so one can rather easily get to Route 126 by just here. So, okay. Okay. All right, let's see what we got. Hopefully one of these is not a dupe. Uh, it's a dupe. Throw it into the ocean. That's a dupe. Throw it into the ocean. Hey, Pichu! Hey, it's a Pichu! It's a Machu Pichu! Okay, so what are we getting Pichu? What are we naming Pichu? Pichu's a girl. We could do Natalie Portman. P-O-R-T-M-A-N. So we could do N Portman. I think we just do N Portman. All right, we officially have over 60 Pokemon alive and well. Let's go get a few more encounters here. Woo! Okay, Corsola it is, level 80. Yeah.
One yeah HG. All right, we got Corsola. I wasn't even paying attention. What kind of what kind of so Corsola is a girl. We just got a lot of girls. Jennifer Corsa Lawrence, Amy Poehler. Oh, Emma Stone. Okay, I like that. Do we already have an Emma Stone though? Sorry, we'll do Amy Poehler for somebody else. It's a cruel summer. Uh, tentacles are always so scary to catch because they're actually really strong and stuff. Um, this is a girl again. Courtney Cox. I could see that, I guess. So Courtney Cox doesn't fit even as Courtney C. We'd have to do C Cox. <laughs> C Cox. It was unavoidable. We had to do it. Um, okay. We move on. Ah, 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 ah. What is he doing? All right, we made it to Pacific Lodge. Is there anything that I can get in Pacific Lodge? Or is it eggy time? Ah, oh, I can get Skrelp from here. <gasps> you can get Delmize. Let's get Delmize. Show me Delmize. Hey, cool. That was easy. Uh, it's 20%. All right, Delmise. 81. We're gonna just catch this. We're gonna make this easy, right? Got it. We're gonna do an O Bloom. The soul of the seaweed adrift in the waves becomes reborn as this Pokemon. It maintains itself with new infusions of seabed detritus and seaweed, love. Uh, yeah, yeah. O Bloom is fine. We got so many Pokemon. Ooh. Oh my god, I totally forgot. I just have a shitload of eggs in here. So, um, so we got Route 132, 133, and 134. Uh, actually, we already have Route 134, so it's just 33 and 32. So that's all the same stuff. So we actually straight up can't get anything here. Let's hatch these bad boys. All right, let's see. Is Mati short for Matthew or Matthias or something? Nope. Oh, okay, Rhyhorn. That was easy. All right, what are we naming Rhyhorn? We got Rhyperior. That's pretty cool. I do like Ryan Reynolds or Gosling, but it just doesn't fit. We could do Ryan G. I guess we can do Ryan G. What about like this? What about Ryan Goss? Ryan Goss. Let's see what we get. Hey, Shuppet! Oh my goodness, it's so cute. All right, what are we naming? Shuppet is a girl. Should we name it Miss Flo? <laughs> I want to name it Miss Flo. All right. Hey, nice. Okay. Sneasel. What are we naming Sneasel? Halle, Halle Berry, like Haley. Adina Sneasel. I would love that. It just doesn't fit. Uh, but like, if you just do Adina, I mean, I guess she's also frozen, so that's fine. We can do Adina Sneasel. All right, we'll just do Adina. All right, so the only one we didn't get, Taylo. And I don't think it's worth just going and, oh, Taylo and Emolga. I'm fine with that. Taylo would be pretty, pretty lit, but whatever. So we've pretty much gotten all the encounters we can left now. If I really want to, I can go for more eggs in um, Sutopolis. The only encounters we have for the rest of the game, basically, Unless we want to do more eggs in Sutopolis and theoretically like Route 129 because I didn't get an encounter there. The only other ones then are Cave of Origins, Seafloor Cavern, Evergrande City, and Victory Road. So. <laughs>